Hey guys, what's up? Today I got a UU match. This one is against Starminus, and I uh, figure he's going to lead it with his Ambipom or his Jolteon. Nothing else really looks like a lead, so I'm going to go with Registeel because Ambipom can't do shit to me, even with the low kick, because I'm, you know, physically defensive. And Jolteon, even if he specs with Thunderbolt, that still won't do a lot, despite me not having any special defensive investment. So uh, I'm just going to do that. Uh, get Stealth Rocks up, Toxic, and Thunder Wave, and anything I really feel like it. Shaman's the only thing that mind doesn't mind it, excuse me, because uh, he's got Natural Cure. But, um, yeah, the thing is that, uh, I don't know, I, I should have expected Taunt. Not a lot of heavy pumps usually like to learn, or not learn Taunt, uh, have Taunt, excuse me. Um, so I don't know, I, mean, I, I should have just went for Seismic Toss just to be safe, but... Eh, that's fine. I'm going to switch out because, uh, as again, as I said, the only thing that can hit me with is a little kick. So uh, I'm going to go to my Miss Magus, but he's going to Thunder Wave me. I'm like, why would you Thunder Wave a Registeel? I guess he's predicting the switch, but most Registeel have Iron Head or Seismic Toss, and I could have went for that. I don't, I don't know. Um, he's going to go for the U-turn. He told me there was a misclick. He wanted to taunt, which um, ends up working out perfectly for him because I went for the Hidden Power Fighting, and that would have done uh, probably not enough to kill considering um, it's not Life Orb or anything and I have no boosts, but it would do a lot. And, um, yeah, but uh, Melodic's going to come in and sponge that hit very well. And uh, I'm just going to switch out to my Togekiss because it's my special wall and I can get rid of my status. And uh, I'll be fine. He's going to go for the Surf and that's going to do uh, relatively nothing because, uh, again, I'm specially defensive and lefties heals like half of that damage so whatever uh, I'm just gonna go for the air slash figure maybe get some flinches off um, you know the only other thing I can do is thunder wave or heal bell and heal bell not really a priority of mine right now I will want to get it off eventually but right now I'm not too um, concerned about it uh, he's gonna go for the protect I don't really know why I guess he wanted to scout for a switch or a potential toxic or something but um yeah, no, I have Thunder Wave. I'm a pair of flinching special defensive wall. Just kind of like a Jirachi, except just different type and different stats and things like that. Uh, he's going to go for Stealth Rocks and just going to keep air slashing him. thing is, he's faster, which means he's got some investment, which is, um, I don't know, kind of annoying, because I'm pretty sure Glagor Speed is not 80. It's I think it's like 70 or something. Ah, doesn't really matter. Uh, he's going to Toxic me. Uh, I was hoping his air slash would kill, but it doesn't, thanks to his Violate. Um, he's going to go for the Roost, which is fine. I figured he'd have it after seeing Protect, um, which means he's a full stall Gligar, which I, uh, I'm going to keep in mind for later. I'm just going to go for the Heal Bell. Don't really care if he heals up. Toxic is the only way of damaging me. And uh, now that I know he doesn't have Earthquake, uh, I'm fine to just, you know, not be worried by this Gligar at all. Um, he's going to switch out to his Jolteon. Well, I go out to my uh, Registeel just to avoid the Toxic and uh, potentially set up a Stealth Rock and sort my own Toxic and stuff like that. But, yeah, he goes out to his Jolteon. Uh, as I said at the top of the video, I am not worried about a Choice Specs Thunderbolt because it's not even a 2 KO. Uh, though I figure he's probably going to want to Volt Switch because he can no nowhere come nowhere close to uh, one-hit KOing me. He is going to Volt Switch out. That is modest. Uh, damage with uh, no attack boosting item, so that means it's either, you know, Lumberry or uh, Leftovers for some stupid reason, neither of those make sense. Uh, I figured Scarf maybe, but Expert Belt probably, because, like, why would you have a Scarf Jolteon? It's definitely not Life Orb or Specs damage, that's absolutely positive. Um, so, yeah, uh, I'm gonna just get up my uh, my rocks and I'm gonna go to Miss Magius on the off chance that he wants a Rapid Spin, uh, and that's exactly what he wants to do. Um, I'm just gonna go for the, uh, Shadow Ball? Yeah, I go for the Shadow Ball just to do some damage because I figure I want to see if he maybe has Stone Edge, although I should have probably gone for Sub because if he has that or Sucker Punch, it would have been nice to scout it out. I don't know why I went through for the Shadow Ball. That was kind of risky. Though, um, yeah, I don't know. The way he switches out gets me to think he's not gonna have, um... Stone Edge and probably has Sucker Punch and probably went to Jolteon just out of fear of me subbing so that he could get a uh, hit off and break my sub and then go out to a uh, certain counter or whatever. Or if I calm minded, he probably could have just went for the Shadow Ball. But no, I'm going to go out to my Togekiss. He's going to Volt Switch again. I predicted him to Shadow Ball, obviously. Um, and that would have done nothing, but it does a lot. And I'm like, eh, that's not a big deal. He's going to go for the normal gem fake out, 
which is uh, kind of annoying. Um, I mean, normal gem fake out's nice, but it's like, why don't you just have like silk scarf? That way you can keep coming in, and it's like 20% boosted every time, as opposed to being only 50% boosted once. I, I don't know. It, I guess it depends on how much you're planning on using your palm. But I'm gonna go to my champ. And uh, I was expecting to go to the Gligar, so I went for the uh, Ice Punch. Unfortunately, I'm actually faster. That means he's not jolly. Um, which is stupid, because now I look foolish that I didn't go for the Fighting-type move. Which is not Dynamic Punch, it is Close Combat. That is my Guts Scarfed Machamp. Um, and I really wanted to, to work. Basically, just come in on a status, uh, mostly Will-O-Wisp or Toxic, and then just Close Combat anything. Um, and that's an extremely powerful hit, and it's going to basically kill everybody. But uh, that's not what happens. i got to switch up to my Magius. He's going to Rapid Spin again. I'm going to go for the sub, uh, you know, thinking at this point he has Sucker Punch, and that's exactly what he has. Uh, now he's kind of in trouble. Uh, I'm going to go for the Calm Mind on the Switch because I know he's probably only got, like, uh, Close Combat, Sucker Punch, pers or not Pursuit, uh, Rapid Spin, and... Uh, I honestly don't know what else. Maybe Mock Punch. I'm not really sure. But uh, I'm going to go for the Shadow Ball because, again, I'm just like, crap. <laughs> you know, again, I just assumed he'd be faster, but I already knew he wasn't Jolly. So why did I think I'd be faster? Because I know I will outspeed him because I am max speed. And uh, base 115s without the plus speed nature are 329 speed, which is just over positive speed 100s. So uh, I could have hidden Power Fighting, and uh, that would have been a kill. Uh, but... You see here, it's going to get repaid because he goes for the Earth Power, forgetting that I have Levitate, as uh, almost every ghost does, except um, Driftblim, because uh, he's flying type, and that would be a Rotom spin kind of thing to do. Um, well, and, you know, Sableye and Bennett aren't, but they're, like, standing on the floor. Anyways, whatever. Um, so he's going to switch out and take the Shadow Ball, obviously. Uh, I'm going to go... And he's going to switch out again. I don't really know why. Um, he really needed... This Jolteon is like literally the only thing on a scene that's faster. So he really should have saved it. Um, gone into maybe hit him on top and Sucker Punch. Got rid of my sub and then... But again, I, I already have Calm Minds up. And it's like, it's just... I don't know. It's not that... But I mean, it was his only chance. But then again... Uh, like I told him, it's mostly team composition because uh, Miss Magus is actually really dangerous if you don't have something specific for it. Um, I mean, all you really need is a specially defensive poke that can take a couple shadow balls and can dish out a decent amount of damage. Uh, unfortunately, this Melodic is not even going to be able to break my sub after uh, plus two, which is why I go for the Calm Mind. And now I'm going to go to Substitute, and as you see here, proof and evidence, this Surf is not going to break my sub. Max damage is somewhere around 23%, which uh, will never break a sub, because subs are 25%. Uh, and that is exactly why I went for the Calm Mind last turn. So now I'm just going to go with the Shadow Ball, because I know it'll do uh, quite a bit of damage. And it's obviously my best move to hit her, unless I want to just sit in here and get to plus 6, which I don't really want to do. Um, and there's a diminishing return on Calm Minds anyway, so it's not... Yeah, I'm already plus 2, it's good enough. Um, I'm just going to go with Shadow Ball. I do get the special defense drop, although um, it's not that it you know really mattered. But again, I could have went for the Shadow Ball here and just killed him, but I figure I go for the sub... Uh, in case he wants to switch up to save his uh, Melodic, but he didn't even notice. So I'm like, okay, he goes for Toxic. But I'm like, dude, I could have killed you with a Shadow Ball. He's like, why? I'm like, well, you got a special defense drop. And he's like, oh. So uh, now he's going to switch up to save his Melodic. But that's, eh, again, I mean, I, I could have just killed it with a Shadow Ball, but it's like, eh, whatever. He's going to go into his Hitmon top, and he's going to take uh, quite a bit of damage from the Shadow Ball. It's going to do almost enough to kill him. But, um, again, Miss Magius doesn't really have that great power. It's only 105. But, again, its speed is 105 too, and so is its special defense. Every other stat is 60. So, uh, it's it's a really good Pokemon, and it's just, you know, again, it's, it's got options. Substitute, Calm Mind. Uh, funny thing is, actually, I almost brought my Nasty Plot set, which would have done far worse in this uh, situation, because uh, I wouldn't have um, Substitute to be able to dodge the Sucker Punch from this Hitmon top. Um, but at this point, it's basically over. I mean, I have enough power, and again, his Jolteon's dead, and the only thing he can do is hit him on top. Um, he could have potentially taunted me with his uh, Ambipom, but now that I'm 
know I'm faster, I can just kill him, so it's not a big deal. But uh, if he had went to it early and taunted me and then just forced me uh, to, uh, you know, take sucker punches, but then again, I could have, you know, obviously switched out, um, so it wasn't a big deal. Um, but, you know, I mean, it's no hacks, so uh, I consider this a good game. Uh, like I said yesterday, most people probably wouldn't because it's like a 5-0 sweep. But it's like, mm, it's not like either of us played stupid other than this dumb moves that we both made like right after each other. Um, so, I don't know. I, I mean, I guess you could consider it a bad match. But again, like I said, it's mostly team comp. You just... There's nothing to check the Smages, and if you don't, then it's just like any Pokemon. I mean, if you don't have a check for Heracross, he's going to sweep you. If you don't have a check for, you know, freaking even Jolteon, he's going to sweep you. Like, if you, if you don't have a, a good you know, electric resist or ground type that's fast enough, uh, especially if it's an expert belt or a life orb set, then, you know, you need a good ground type. Uh, but, again, HP Ice is going to ruin you, and just, so it's like... I don't know. I, I, I really don't see this as being a bad match. Because, again, no one really played badly. Um, there was no real hacks. So, I don't know. Um, well, that's my opinion, and yours could be different. Whatever. Um, I had fun. I, I, <laughs> I can't really talk about the match, because all that's really happening is me killing his Pokemon. Um, I could have shaved off two turns with when his Gligar came in before. Instead of subbing, I could have just Shadow Bolt and probably killed him. But I wanted to get up next Calm Mind because um, I knew I wouldn't be able to uh, one-hit KO his Melodic from his health. And I knew he had no moves to hit me other than Toxic, so I just went for the substitute. And that's why I did that. So, other than that, uh, like I said, multiple times, good match to me. Um, if I were in his shoes, I'd, I'd be mad that it was like that, but it's like... It was still a good match, because it's just like, oh, Miss Magus, you know. But, anyways, enough rambling on for the past, like, five minutes, because, uh, you know, sweep and stuff. But, yep, uh, I hope you guys enjoyed the battle, and um, I'll have to get more Starminus, I know. I'm pretty sure I've beaten him every time i played him. Uh, or her? I don't know, whatever, it doesn't matter. I'll uh, see you guys tomorrow.